all right all right all right welcome back you guys i'm so sorry for not being right on the timer i'm used to having like a 10 minute timer and so i'm kind of playing around with the whole me potentially having uh just like a five minute timer just so it's a little bit shorter for you guys in the beginning but i still have enough time to get my stuff in order hey what's up it's your boy yes son and welcome to another episode on izb tv in today's episode of Happily Elden After, we're going to be playing as Mariana. She is uh, about to say blood and bubbles. <laughs> but um, that's like kind of like the tagline for her is Mariana blood and bubbles. But she is a combination of a apparent heretic as well as a blood initiate. Those are two starting classes for the Convergence mod. You get a path note whenever you start the game. And so... Our goal is always to collect everything on the path note, which is usually runes that collect or contain spells and armor that makes your character usually buffed up according to your build and then also weapons. So today, since we've collected all of the runes for the blood initiate and the apparent heretic, we're going to be collecting the armor set for the blood initiate. That's going to be three of them, three different armor sets for the blood initiate and then all of the weapons for the apparent heretic. Okay, I know that was a mouthful, but I just want to like get you guys kind of like caught up on like where we are, what we're doing so far. I always have it listed in the chat just in case you're like, where are we? What are we doing? I always update it as we go and that, but okay, 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 okay. Also with the bubbles part, you guys are like, what about the bubbles? I just hear a lot of blood going on around here. So with the bubbles, the bubbles in particular come from the Dragonkin Faint Rune. It's how you get the bubbles that you blow. We tried doing the Envoy's Horn, but I'm not going to lie, guys. Two minutes of playing around with that, it's just such an obnoxious sound that I just, like, I'm like, no, I can't do that to me. I can't do that to you guys. <laughs> so I decided to take that out. All right. So I want to check the volume in the ever really quick just because I'm kind of playing around with new volume. I want to make sure that you guys can actually hear. And of course, is what I'm saying, just such an obnoxious sound, like my voice, my like nasally teacher from Charlie Brown wah, 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 voice, <laughs> my like everybody else is on whippets except for me <laughs> voice. <laughs> Everyone just. <sighs> All right, you guys. So if you ever want to know what's going on, I keep it in the chat. Kind of an idea of where we are, what we've done. And as we go along, I always, like, update it and be like, okay, check off this armor, check off this weapon. And, lucky for everyone here in the group, myself extremely included, I did a little bit of, like, research beforehand, so I have an idea of where everything is and ever. Like, I have, like, an actual, okay, we're gonna go here, 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 instead of dinking around. And, for you and me both, I looked up how to get to Volcano Manor, even though we've done it a quite a few times i always forget and then i dink around like we're doing now but okay mm, welcome to the live stream thank you guys for joining me today we're playing remember mariana blood and bubbles blood initiate apparent heretic dragonkin faint rune bubble spells blood bubbles happily elden after elden ring happily ever after snow white happily elden after you guys, you can get a look at my nails. If you ever see me randomly click onto the map while I'm fighting, it's because of these bad boys. These bad boys. I'll be, like, playing and that kind of stuff, and then I, like, click this as I'm, like, going around like this. Oh, wait. Oh, my gosh. I'm not even showing the camera, you guys. I'm crazy. So I'll, like, literally with my long-ass nails, be like, start, start, start. And I'm like, I'm just trying to do the toggle. I'm crazy. Okay. Let's do this, you guys. Elden Ring. You guys. I don't know if I told you about this yet, but I accidentally deleted one of my characters that was my very first character I ever made on Elden Ring back in the day when it first came out, and it had 255 hours on it, <laughs> and I accidentally deleted it. <laughs> I didn't mean to, but we still have a really sassy roster of not only a bunch of our happily Elden After characters, but also Holden, Dem, Butts, one of our real life Prince Shadow Kevin's characters. Also, her 
as a cane, which is a play on hur hurricane. Um, this one does a lot of wind stuff, her as a cane. And then holding them butts is a necromancer. Necromancer, just like Tina, grabbing them zombie booties and holding them butts. <laughs> but today, we're playing as Mariana. Mariana. And I want to look at the volume just real quick when we first start off. Why are we here? Why are we in deep root depths? Please tell me it was just so that we could get that. That Oh, do we need anything down here? I don't think we need anything down here. I don't think we need anything down here. I don't think so. But I do want to look at... I'm trying to remember what I was supposed to be looking at. <laughs> Cause we do have the one that one set, right? Yeah, Bloodhound Knight Armor. Okay, cool. So we do have that one checked on our checked off on our list. Let's check our little cute listicles. So let's check on the Path of the Blood Initiate. If we look at this guy, it says the notable armor sets are found in Shaded Castle. It's the House Mariah set. The House Mariah's uh, not in the Shaded Castle. It's to the left of it. Then we have Sanguine Noble set. That's going to be kind of like kitty corner for one of the trees in the uh, Consecrated Snowfield. That guy will be pretty easy to find. He might be hard to defeat. He'll probably kick my butt. <laughs> um, then we have White Reed set. That one's going to be in the Spirit Collar Cave. That one's going to be in the next plateau up of the snow area. Kind of in the mountaintop of the Giants area. So we'll grab those guys. Then we've got Weapons for the Blood Initiates. And those ones, I've same thing. Oh wait, not that one. We're not doing weapons on this one. Weapons is gonna be next live stream, next playthrough. But for the weapons of the Adherent Heretic, I looked up all these guys and that kind of stuff, whatever, and I'm pretty confident that not only can we do all of these ones in this stream today, but I think I think we I think we could like do it without getting too distracted. I know that's me we're talking about here. I know that's me we're talking about. However. That's straight up from Ryan Hollinger. If you ever hear me say hoy ever, I don't say however like that. I just love how Ryan Hollinger, he's a YouTuber that does a lot of like uh, reviews on scary movies or horror movies and ever I should say. But instead of however, he says hoy ever. And I kind of love it. But all right. So in order to do this one, the Mariah's Executioner Sword, as well as that armor set that's the Mariah set, those are two from the same people. So we're going to go to the Shaded Castle. Lucky for you guys, we already have a grace there. I said lucky for you guys. <laughs> I hope you guys can hear me okay. I've, I'm kind of trying to play around with this, but I kind of want to just bring the microphone closer. I want you guys to be closer. But I'm afraid that like it's not going to be able to like pick me up the way that I want it to. Out. Oh, I just forgot to start the timer. I even thought to myself in the ever, like, I was like, you son, remember? The Oven Timer. Okay. All right. We've now officially started. Okay. Nobody saw that. Hey, welcome back. It's your boy, your son. <laughs> we totally remember the timer, and it's not like a hundred hours into live streaming, and I forget the timer every time. I would love for it to start like immediately, just start in the game. Let's just do that from now on. Okay. So we're gonna go up here. And it says it's going to be to the left. So we want to go up here. All right. All right, 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 all right. I hope you guys are having an excellent day today. It's definitely a certain splendiferous occasion for some people. All fond of their herbal essences and whatnot. I, too, am... A fan of yes. <laughs> okay, we want to go to that blue dot. That's where Mariah is. Oh, we got this, guys. Oh, we can even get a little star. Oh, where's oh two? Where's my hug, guys? You guys, no. Oh, who taught you? Who taught you manners? Sue, so, mm -mm. bros. Oh, you saving that really nasty 
armpit only hug for me, dude. Thank you. Wow. The best. The best guy. Where's the punishment? Teleconnect shell. Uh oh. Forget what these are. I've, <laughs> I haven't played since last week, so I gotta remember what everything is now. Get some spice. I didn't do the space jam. Wiggle your hands in the air if you feel fine. Touch me. Where's your hugs now, bitch? Where's your hugs now? Got anti gross guy armor on right now. I've got zero hug bubble. A colossal somber stone? That's actually pretty dope, guys. We're gonna use that. Uh uh. See that? Wrong kind of tickles, my friend. Wrong kind of tickles. Is that a chest we haven't opened? Just to make sure there's no one in here. But there probably still is. What's in this? Oh, it's Millicent's arm. <laughs> Blossom's sister. Oh, cute. I love Millicent. That totally... 100% made me cry. I want to look at it real quick. I want to see what it does. Because it might look really cool next to it. And I would love to bring that back. Why not? I feel like it's gold. There he is. That's Godric's gauntlet. All knowing. Where it be? Oh, no, 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 no. This is different. This is different. This is a key item. This is a key item. There's key items. Yeah, it's a key item. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we can't wear it. That's okay. We just have to keep ourselves focused on that blue dot. Uh-oh. Too focused! Alright guys, part of my You should guide your that way. Part on. No hug. That's not go. Okay, so Mariah's gonna be popping up here somewhere. I'm scared. There's probably gonna be those like freaking what's it called? The Virgin Abductors? I bet you anything, guys. But Mariah, she kind of looks like a Zammer person. But not really. There she is. There she is. You guys, I did not put any health in yet. There we go. <gasps> they didn't even touch her. They didn't even get her. Oh, not Crimson Rose. Crimson Rose is too big. Not what I want. Mariah. What are you doing, baby? There we go. She's gonna like one stab me. She's just playing with me. She's just cat and mouse me right now. Come to the bubbles. Come to the bubbles. Oh, she. <gasps> Wait for it. Yeah, buddy. So we got the Mariah's mask, the Mariah's robe, the blood soaked machetes. Don't hit me yet. Don't hit me yet. Oh, dang it. And we got the wraps. Ah! Rebels, no. Oh, you run from the bubbles? Oh, I asked for that, you guys. Okay, let's see if we can get a little. Yeah? No, let's get a little. This guy is tanky. Oh, I 
ass for that. What? <laughs> I'm sorry, Bobby. He's gonna throw rocks, so watch out. Pullback. I was even waiting for it. I was waiting for him to do the pullback. Blood and bubble. Blood and bubble. My booty. Mm -mm. That stinky bum shit? Nah. Almost, you guys. Almost. Oh, I asked for that, guys. Your cute little feet. Not that one. I don't think I like crystal or whatever that crimson comet thing is. Nah, dog. That ain't it. Night, Becky. Good night. Good night, Becky. Back to the land of the Beckys. I'll remember you fondly. I'll remember you taller. You were so tall. <gasps> Do you guys remember him so tall? Uh oh. Refresh that thing, Miss Annabella. Oh, then I also have to update that chat real quick. So we'll do... Grab my pen. There it is. Thank you guys for your patience as I do this. It really helps me out so much when I'm editing later. And it helps me out for when I make chapters. That way when we're watching it read back together. Read back. When you're watching it replayed. And that it will also have chapters in that for you guys. So we got check mark. And we got... Mariah's set. We'll do it for armor. In parentheses. Maybe like that kind of parentheses. Build a mess. Gorgeous. Then we got that one. <clears throat> oh, wait. I don't know if it gave us the weapon though let's check let's check let's check or update that one because we for sure got the set for sure maybe it's up around here because <clears throat> i don't think we picked it up is it this large mything stone that is not it gang let me double check yeah mariah's executioner sword bam you guys we did it we did. Okay. So we got... Uh, wait. Mariah's... Executioner...
sorry, you guys. I'm so crazy. You guys probably just see, like, the top of my head, like, did he just, like, go somewhere else? Did he, like, nod off? <laughs> no, I'm here. Why is Executioner sword? Bam! All right, you guys, that's two things off of our list. Let's check. Cause of Bloodlust build up. As well as what? It's physical damage, cause blood slash. The dancing blade. Oh, I think it's like the <laughs> kind of one, if that makes any sense. <laughs> um, I think it takes a certain amount of dexterity that we don't have yet. And strength. It takes 24 strength and 14 dexterity. We are nowhere near those stats. But it's off our list, you guys. It's off our list. Let's do... Inventory, check our list. Weapons. Next one's gonna be Fort Laid, so that's gonna be towards the um, Volcano Manor. We'll definitely do that as we're going to Volcano Manor. That's gonna also get us the Juno Hoslo, or about it's the Hoslo Petal Whip, and the Bloodhound Claws. So we'll definitely wanna do that. Camp at least to Lyernia. I would say really quick, let's go grab. I would say let's go grab the Crimson Briar Bow from the Cave of Knowledge, and let's go grab the Shield of Shield of the Guilty from the camp in East of Laernia, because those two will be in the same place, and then the rest of the ones will be in the same location for the other ones, at least close by. That way, it's like it's not like I'm trying to like keep it a little more concise. I know me explaining this doesn't seem like I'm trying to make it more concise, but I'm trying to like. I don't know. Not waste you guys' time. Keep it on like somewhat of like more of a through path instead of a oh. So to get to the Cave of Knowledge, it says that the Cave of Knowledge is going to be somewhere down here. And to get there, it says it wants us to be basically in this area. So we're going to want to teleport to probably here and just make our way that way. It'll be a lot faster. Yeah, so we'll do that. And then for East Lake of Laernia, that one's going to be above the Artist Shack. Yeah, like right. It says it should be like about north and then up at the camp. Okay. Let's go to the Artist Shack one real quick because that one I'm pretty sure should be just like like a split, like a split. So beautiful you guys like all we did was just load to this area and look at how beautiful that is I can't understand it like oh this game freaks me out sometimes like, look at this this is just a video game you can walk around here you can run around here what is this place so yeah everything I was reading was saying that it should be at the camp that's like north of here and I think it's supposed to be the camp that where we started <clears throat> and I think I didn't want to do it because I was so scared and I was so little and so weak and so baby but we are not baby no more we are big bubbles big bubbles I see you pustulating over there you guys don't remember me I'm here to make a scene I'm here to cause trouble I'm here to pop some bubbles that's great. He gets it. The sheep gets it. So I remember Briars of Punishment. That looks way too close to like the Crimson Rose one. Catch. Oh, you caught that so good. I gotta remember that like my weapon does not have an affinity for um uh oh uh oh I asked for that guys I straight up asked for that I know how to dodge for that I I know how to dodge that I, I'm big bubbles I promise I'm big bubbles big bubbles no yeah our, as much as like I love using the bubbles it the, our weapon doesn't have an affinity for it so it makes it oh 
I want to take out Blood Comet also. This just uses a lot of magic. Maybe we should try Crimson Rose somewhere. Look at it. Gross. It's like when you see those like thumbnails that are like, I found this in my insert blah 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 chicken place. Ew. Yeah, no. Mm -mm. I heard you, Becky. You're such a big wound. Who the fire? Mm -mm. Oh, this guy. This guy. How does he like the bubbles? I don't. Oh, that guy is gonna be the one that gets me. Oh, it's when they all start going at you. Oh, whoa. Cause you got rangers. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Okay, stop jumping. Drink a flask. And just don't panic. Take it slow, take it easy, take it slow. Oh, I forget you got that wicked pullback, baby. We get a little bit of that on you. Uh oh, I asked for this. Oh, not bad, not bad. Nope. Oh, did you guys see him absolutely blow up that tent? What? Oh, and now he's got fire whip activated. What? Bruh, no way. That was cool, dude. That was cool. I definitely would have put that big red dress on if I was you. That was cool. Yes. All right, you guys. Shield of the guilty. Ba boom 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 bam 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 We got the shield of the guilty you guys thank you thank you thank you Shield of the Shield of the Guilty Bam, you guys. Awesome. Dude, it's so cool, you guys. Can't wait for you guys to see it. Let's put it in probably the left hand if we have it. Can't, can't wait, you guys. Look at how cool that is. It's like a face completely enrobed in all of these briars. Oh, okay. Let's check it out. Let's read it. Let's read it. Let's read it. Let's read it. Oh, so we just barely got Shield of the Guilty. Let's read its flavor text. Click, to click on it. Shield made to venerate maiden whose eyes were crushed by the briars of sin before being reborn in the lands. This shield increases the damage of abhorrent sorceries by 10%. That's kind of wild. That's kind of crazy. Special skill does Shield Bash, and you can... Um, just basically bash your shield with it. But isn't it so cool? So we could shield bash if we wanted to. So we'd probably want to have it, if we ever had it as like a spell buff, we would probably want to have it in our right hand. Because then it would make this kind of stuff 10% stronger. Kind of crazy, you guys. Kind of crazy. <laughs> All right. So we got that one. That was really quick at the artist shack. I told you guys. I told you guys. I told you guys. 
Not too crazy, not too crazy. Oh, I switched this up real quick, one second. Bam. There we go. I can make sure I got the chat open just in case. Take a drink real quick. But we're going to be teleporting over to this place while I take a drink. We want to get there. So we're probably going to go here. And then just make our way downtown. The Weeping Peninsula. We just want to start heading this way. That way I don't get lost. Because <laughs> sometimes I get lost or I get distracted. We make our way down there. Oh, and this is in the grass. Make sure we collect our little blue dots. I want to have a word with you, mister. Oh. <laughs> Did you hit me just by, like, <laughs> unmounting from your gunplate? What were you stabbing at, buddy? Oh, that was some good poise, my guy. That was some good poise. Let's do some bubbles. Nice, buddy. Good night. Great smithing stone, yes. I'll always take smithing stones. Smithing stones of any kind, give me them. Nom 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 nom. Oh, 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 oh. Sorry, Torrent, we got a douchebag. Douchebag alert. No. All right, now, of course. Should we do the ever gel real quick? I bet it's something really easy. I mean, we're in, like, Weeping Peninsula. But it's all about, like, not only stats, but also, like, what you're stacking up against one another. Looks like we already did it. <laughs> so we are going to skip it. All right, so it looks like you're supposed to jump down to, like, this beach area down here but kind of makes me nervous because <laughs> doesn't appear that there's like an airstream and that it looks like it does the same thing like as if you did jump into an airstream and it catches you softly but you don't see an airstream okay they were basically like kind of kitty corner like up in this area whoop So exactly. Oh wait, no, no, no. This was right. This was right. Cause they were like. Cause there should be a beachy area that we can jump down to. I think it's over there. We might have to go up one more level. Pardon me, buddy. There's a grass. Oh my gosh, Grace Kelly, I love you. The beautiful, beautiful, gorgeous little mermaid blossom. In charge of blood and bubbles, goddess of the water.
if you see this, like, just down here. Oh my gosh, it's right there, you guys. No way. No way. Right. Better eat those bubbles. Whoa. Big boy bumps. Hi, Becky. <laughs> it's the perfect combo, you guys. Nobody knew. Pardon. Looking for a cave, you guys. Have you seen it? Not that. I think I'm heading the right way. Those environmental sounds are so weird. An enchanted remnant? That's dope. Is that the inside starting place? Oh. How curious. How curious. When you do the tutorial at the beginning of, like, the regular Elden Ring, you s That's where you are. That's so weird. It's weird seeing it from up here. There it is, guys. There it is. Wait. We're just here. The stranded graveyard. This is peculiar. How interesting. Where's my hug, guys? And they're explodey ones, too. Oh, I'm switching between like shields and that, guys. Being crazy. I'm trying to switch for this. I want my shield to be on like my left hand side. Whoa! No, bad Becky. Bet we could get all of them with this. That's right. 
that's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. I want to get that little guy. That's all I want, that's okay. Uh oh. Okay, <laughs> now I can sufficiently heal. It's fine! Whoa! Buddy, I wanted to play with you up, up top. Slow to fall. This guy really walks through the raindrops. Whoa. No hugs, buddy, no hugs, no hugs. Okay, guys, I really need to use the restroom. So I'm gonna go over here and pray that it's safe. I'm gonna have you guys watch the controller for me really quick. Just watch the controller while I go use the restroom really quick. I'll be right back. Oh, you guys did so good at watching the controller for me. Thank you guys so much. Oh, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. You guys are awesome. Throw my headphones back on. Yeah, you guys were like the last two seconds of that. I was like, whoa! <laughs> like, panic! I'm gonna get like two of them. Got one of them. Look at the hell! <laughs> so we don't even have a rune equipped. I think we've defeated like a stealth or someone. They're not. She's. He's not like a rune bearer though. I think we actually don't get those till the boss run. was 
weird. Did you see them like all like appear and then disappear? Hear you, Becky. So many of those guys hidden in here. What is this place? I don't know if I've ever been through here. Like vanilla or this. Like, what is this place? Like, we're like right here. Underneath all of this. Where's he got a where's my hug guy? Uh oh. Dog first. Dog first. Whew. Later, Becky. There's a boss room? What? Okay, 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 okay. I need a drink. What? What? Okay. So we got our sister equipped. What spells we got right now? We got Blood Comet, Briar Wrapped Armament, Shingling Briars, Briar's Punishment, Telekinetic Shell, Frozen Bubbles. Okay. Let's do this one for sure. We've got two, two. Okay. We'll have that one equipped. Get her blood bubble going. Oh, it's one of these guys. Mm -mm. Oh, big swings, buddy. Big swing. Oh, big swing, dude. I felt it. that guys being too cocky get some bubbles get some bubbles going oh you dodged through the bubbles you're too clever Becky oh no oh no this is, oh, I felt it. Can you guys see? I was stuck inside of this little teeny crevice. <gasps> we would have got him in the first try, though. We would have got him in the first try. Oh, okay, that's so crazy. So wait, was there a grace down there? Oh, steak of Makira. That's perfect. That's perfect. We can do steak of Makira. I didn't realize it was a bloodhound, Knight. That's silly. Oh, right here. Perfect, you guys. Perfect. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. All right. So let's get that going. Get our briar wrapped armament going. You guys, you're embarking like a dog. Come on, what the hell? I almost got stuck on that same thing again, you guys. No! Trick a flask on it! Oh! There 
there we go. Oh my gosh, you guys. <laughs> He's like sitting there just like melting my health flasks. Yeah. We got our next weapon, you guys. The Crimson Briar Bow. I don't know what that means <laughs> and ever, but I think it's probably going to be like a mace or a club. I don't know, maybe something like the little bouquet that you get. <gasps> and we also got the Bloodhound Knight Flow. <laughs> Bloodhound Knight Flow. You guys. <laughs> That's exciting. Okay, let's put it on our list and ever. That way it's like we have it checked off for Izzy your son when I'm editing later. That way it's a lot easier for me to see. And then you guys have an idea of like what we're checking off our list as we go. I'm sure, we'll do a big old. Oh, <gasps> bro. I heard you coming in for a hug. I was like, what the hell sounds like some douchebag trying to give me a big, greasy, sweaty, greasy, flowery blow up hug. No. No. <laughs> okay. And so we just really got the, it was the Crimson Briar Bow. Crimson. Briar. Bow. We'll put a little weapon by it because it's a weapon at least i think it's a weapon it could be a shield but i'm pretty sure it's a weapon all right you guys let's check it out the great hammer oh you guys look at it a weapon of the lost kingdom of eochad bloody and writhing said to be once wielded by i think it's eochad i don't know you guys eochad's grand justiers the briars still contain hidden apparent powers. The skill is briar assault. Animate the hammer with a writhing briar and launch it into a series of wild attacks. Each strike recovers HP and the final strike sends briars of punishment outwards in front of you. Okay. We can like play with it, but it's not going to let us like do anything crazy with it because we aren't strong enough. Oh, you guys. It's going to lie. The big fat sassy magassy. Bam. Okay. So normally, if we had the right stats for it, it would do like the blood animations and all that kind of stuff. Oh. So that one takes That one's not bad. That one only takes 20 strength compared to like What was it? Our last weapon that we just got? This one. This one takes 24 strength and 14 dexterity. The Mariah's Executioner Sword. That's one of those like telekinetic, you can like shoo, 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 kind of swords. Oh, you guys. Okay. So we got that one checked off our list. Let's look back on. Zalisht. So we just got the Crimson Brow Bow. So we need to get to Volcano Manor so that we can grab Hoslo's Petal Whip as a part of the invasion quest and ever for Volcano Manor. And then also the Bloodhound Claws, which is going to be behind Raya's room. We already got the Shield of the Guilty. And then Staff of the Guilty is going to be in the Guardians. Oh, we have to get the Thorn of the Guilty and that kind of stuff. That's in Fort Laid. Okay, so remember, Fort Laid, Hoslo, Bloodhound. Okay. All right, all right, all right. I think we should go back here and see if we can level any of these strings up. What do you guys think? What do you think? Yeah, baby! Oh, we can level up our sister. Oh, and we can level up this guy. I'm thinking about having this guy as like one of our high level summons because he's a bloodhound tonight and we had to like defeat him as a part of our quest. So why not? I love that. And the jellyfish. Okay. So we can do him one, two, three, four, five, six. Are we taking from other jelly? Taking from sister that takes blooming grave? Ghost. Oh. <gasps> Got into a plus seven. Plus eight. Oh, a plus eight bloodhound night flow. Ashen remains in a, in which spirits yet dwell. Used to summon the spirit of flow, bloodhound night. Spirit of bloodhound night, they called the rabid stray. Will attack without pause immediately after being summoned. Flow vowed that there was only one lord that he would s serve, a true king. And so rabid stray never found a master. 
Interesting. Interesting. I like that. You guys. Just go with the flow, you guys. Go with the flow. Oh, blood flow. Okay, let's talk to him. You're sweet. I like you, baby. So that's for a colossal somber stone. This one's going to take somber stones as well. Somber stones. Okay, okay. Because I think I want to play around with the Hoslo Petal Whip. The Petal Whip is really, really, really cool. And we haven't done like a whip related run, and that'd be kind of fun. So, as far as on the list, we need to start heading our cute little patooties. Up to here. How do you get there? Oh, we can actually go here, I think. Yeah, and then we can start making our way this way. Because originally it wanted us to go up this way. So yeah, I think we can start here, you guys. Oh, unless that's like way downstairs. It's way downstairs, but what's the upstairs? Oh yeah, the upstairs should be upstairs where we need to be. Lamp, remember, it's the top one. I always forget that the lamp is on the top. I'm so used to being on the left. I have like 100 hours of playing with the lamp on the left side. Our beautiful bubbles. Blood and bubbles. Mariana. <laughs> Alright. Shmorgeous. Looking good. It's looking proper. <gasps> Sky wolves, just like Terminator spoke of. Wow, well, yeah. Oh, I see you, Becky. I see you. Oh, you had a quick draw on that one. Oh, I don't have any weapon equipped. That's why. Good night, Sky Wolves. Good night. Oh, wait. One more. High fived each other at the same time, Becky. I gotta remember that they do that quick second snap. I'm being silly. Okay. All right. Got a bunch of wanna Beckys over here. What I meant to do. Oh, swing and a miss, Becky. Hi, Becky. heading this way. Now I think that there's going to be the star collar beast at some point. We should probably see if we can face it. Over here and then go there. There should be a ladder down here with that little thing. Catching bubbles, catching bubbles, baby, catching bubbles. That's right. <laughs> Not Bucky. Okay, guys. So then we want to go up. Scavenger's curved sword. That one we actually might be able to use. It's not one that we necessarily want to use, but it's like kind of like a serrated, like really gnarly looking blade. Like it looks like the one blade that every time you open up the knife drawer, you're like, why do we even have that blade? 
I don't think that any of us are barbarous from the Conan clan. What a thrill. Okay. Should be a guy hanging on one of these. There's usually guys hanging on them. Alright. Let's kind of look this one. This guy has my favorite fit. That dark black with like the silver around the top of his head. Watch as it like moves across his head. Oh, that silver. Whoa. Dude, he's got the dopest fit out of all of them. I know that people would argue and say no, but he's so cool. Look at him. I never buy stuff from him. He doesn't really have anything I need, but he has the coolest fit. Confessor hood. Confessor armor. Nobles of Stop. Volcano Pot. You know, we don't really want any of these things. Volcano Pots are really, really helpful because, honestly, most things are susceptible to fire. So if you're ever trying to look for something that's usually pretty good at, like, causing damage to most enemies that obviously aren't fire-based, most, most enemies don't like fire. Right now we're currently trying to make our way to Volcano Manor because there's going to be two weapons in Volcano Manor that we're looking for as well as Fort Laad, I think. It's kind of in the top corner like up here. Yep, Fort Laad's going to be right there and then we want to get to Volcano Manor. So right now we're kind of just like following this route to get there. So we're going to have to do the Star Collar Beast at some point, which I think is just like right up here. It's like really sad. It's like apparently like all of these people when their village was attacked by like all of the madness monsters, the things that kind of look like the Cthulhu beasts, everybody was driven mad. So they're all kind of like sitting and crying around like their friends and everything like that. It's pretty sad. This way. I'm going to go across this. There's so much lore in this game. It's crazy how much like visual storytelling there is, but I love that it's not like crammed down your throat or like, I don't know. Don't get me wrong, I like it when something can just very directly tell you what's going on, and I, I really appreciate it, and I love directness. But I do also just love that with the Souls games, they often have just such wonderful, vivid visual storytelling. Alright, you guys. Let's reset. Let's clean the blood off our face. And then we're going to try the Star Caller Beast. I'm thinking I want to try summoning our sister. And <laughs> never just to have a little bit of distraction because this guy is loshy. Uh oh, uh oh. I meant to dodge that one, you guys. Totally meant to dodge that. Let's do. I'm thinking. Oh, he did the big one. He's supposed to do two of them and then do the big one. This guy is crazy, you guys. Oh, and he is not <laughs> susceptible into the bleed very much. Maybe bubbles? <gasps> bubbles might be the win for this time, you guys. I'm gonna summon our sister. Uh oh, he's coming in for the big hug, big hug. Oh. You be nice to our sister. He's just doing it to our sister. So mean. So ruthless. Mm mm, Becky.
being so mean. Whoa, buddies. Let me get this back on him. What's up, Becky? Oh my gosh, so many of them, you guys. Did you see that? I've never seen him do so many of them in a row. Bruh. Last blast, guys. They're not connecting. I'm being so dumb, you guys. I'm getting too far away from him. Oh, it's so crazy when he does that, guys. Trixie. We want to actually do this one. He's all get some like gradual bleed on his booty. Did you see him like doing the little lightning bolt around me for a second? Uh oh. Sister. The big boy. Wow, 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 wow. <gasps> Murderlation for Sister Bear. What are you doing, cutest little pony? Waste. Waste, guys. Oh, no, not waste. I'm so close, guys. I want to get back the strangling briars. And then maybe we'll finish him with some bubbles. Whoa! No, not in the teeth, buddy. Wow, 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 time. Oh, you're dead, Becky. You're dead. Good night, Becky. Good night. Love you, face. Love you, honey. Love you. Ooh, we got a great somber stone, you guys. We got a large smithing stone. And we got the falling beast jaw. That's something that we're definitely going to use on the muddy run when we're doing um, gravity and strength. 
I love the falling beast jaw. It's such a fun weapon. All right, you guys. <laughs> what that? All right. Got Starlight Shard up there. Sure wish I would have remembered that a minute ago. Because <laughs> then we could have used it during the battle. All right, you guys. A boom, boom, boom. We want to get down to there. A bam, 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 Where's my red bomb? There it is. I'm going to make sure I know where my phone is. Come, oath sworn sister. No, we base for a phrase. Mm -mm. There's a pretty decent range, but it's crazy that it's. Big one, big one. I can even get his guys, it's so strong, it's crazy. Like, if that's not an Excedrin commercial, what is? Night, baby, can't handle the bubbles. The nice thing about coming to Volcano Manor is this will actually get us to Fort Laid. Or Fort Layad? Layad? It'll get us to that place pretty quickly, which is nice. I know that this place is like crazy and sinister and insane, but I love it. I think it's just like such a mood. It fits like that whole fire temple kind of feel so well. Oh, love it. It feels stuffy. It feels warm and stuffy. All right. Drink while we talk to Tanith real quick. Oh, sorry, honey, I didn't mean to ruin your side table. Yes, I broke your table. So hear me out. I kind of just want your key so I can go into your, like, daughter's room to, like, sneak into that back sneaker entrance and get that secret weapon. It's crazy, you guys. If you haven't seen the lore behind, like, Raya and that kind of stuff, check it out. Check out, there's a channel called Miss Chalice. M-I-S-S -S Chalice. Like, you drink Chalice. She has some of the best lore that you could ever read on these characters. And it's just, there's so much story and so much lore going on. Give me the key, Tanith. Thank you, baby. All right. I'm going to grace that thing. Miss Annabella, grace that thing, Miss Annabella. And I'm going to use the restroom really quick, you guys. I'm going to give you guys a cute little BRB screen. You don't need that anymore. And I am going to use the restroom. I'll be right back.
All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, you guys. I am back. I am back. Hey, what's up? It's your boy, your son. As you can see, we're playing Mariana Blood and Bubbles, just in case you guys are tuning in for right now for the first time. That's going to be the Apparent Heretic plus the Blood Initiate. We're gathering everything on their path notes as well as their weapons list. Right now, we're currently working on the Apparent Heretic's weapons as well as the Blood Initiate's armor set. So, <laughs> now that we're back, I wanted to give us um, just a quick second to give a shout out to our latest subscribers. Our three latest subscribers, part of our 10 new subscriber goal. I've set a uh, goal to try and get 10 new subscribers in our happily ever after run. So, thank you, thank you, thank you to our latest three subscribers. First one was Drew Barth. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, Drew Barth. Second one was Carrie and Giles. Thank you so much, Carrie and Giles. Fist bumps. Thank you so much for all your help in our Godfrey run. Thank you, thank you, thank you. To our latest subscriber, Reda Vigo. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys, for bringing us that much closer to our goal. Ooh, getting more people in the polite shade kingdom, joining Snow White and the Dwarf Elves and the cute, handsome shadow Kevin, the sweet Kevin Prince. All right, you guys. Be back. Now that we talked to Tanith, let's go and grab the Bloodhound Claws. That's going to be in this room. And we're going to look for a painting on the wall. Once we see a painting on the wall... Once we see a painting on the wall, we'll know we're in the right room. This should be crooked. Yep. So we got a Volcano Pot. And then you should be able to just roll. You should be able to, like... Just roll because apparently, um, sorry, I have like an alert on the side of my thing. There we go. Oh, please don't tell me that that froze my game. Oh, you guys. So bogus. I hate when this kind of stuff happens. Okay. Let's try exiting out of the game real quick. Hopefully it'll just restart just fine. Ah! There was this little notification that popped up on the side of my screen and... Oh my goodness. It's like not even letting me like exit out of it. guys oh no i'm so sorry that you guys are having to endure this live but that's what we do this for it so we can learn oh i hate when i have to do like a new stream and interrupts the stream I cannot believe that like that little freaking stupid notification jacked it up so much oh it's seriously not letting me exit out of the game so what if we do um what was it Control alt tab no, it just brings up this. Okay. How do you do the whole, um... Control, alt... Delete? No. Task manager. It's not even let us look at the task manager. Oh my goodness, you guys. I might have to restart the stream and that would give me just one second, you guys. Just one second. All right, you guys. We should be back. We should be back. Okay, we should be back. It made me have to reset the timer, but we should be back and never. Let me see. Hope it didn't kick out and do like a new stream. Yeah. Okay. 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 So what I did was like I went to restart it, and then before it restarted, I clicked cancel, and there ever hoping that it would maybe like po like force to shut down the one things. Okay. Hopefully it'll let us go back into the game, or else it's gonna make me have to actually restart. Desktop. 
Oh wait, no, no, not that one. We want to do convergence mod. Oh please, buddy, come on. We can do the task manager now. <clears throat> Task manager. It doesn't look like Elden Ring's running, but yeah, it's doing that thing where it's like not letting me click onto it. So I might have to actually restart, restart the computer. Thank you guys for everyone that's like sitting there watching me like troubleshoot this and that or whatever. It's like I hate feeling like so unprofessional about that and being like, oh, okay. Let's try it one more time. It's probably going to have me restart, restart. Okay. I'll be back in one schmeckerel of a 